So there are a lot of different kinds of Bermudas and the ones you've seen lately on the catwalk are of the slouchy variety. So it's a very cool girl, very downtown New York kind of feel. And this kind of uh, Bermudas you can wear dressed down with a wife beater as I have here. You can wear them with high tops and a trucker cap. But a more flattering and an easier way to get into this trend is to keep your look very, very streamlined. Think long and lean. Anything that will not cling to your body but will sit just so and make you look super skinny is good. So you might want to balance the volume in the bottom by tucking in your top. Another way to elongate your frame is to wear them with stilettos. This kind of makes the most of what little leg you have on show. And if you're going to try to wear this to work, maybe you work in the creative sector, put on a blazer. This will keep your look streamlined and also add a little polish. In general though, slouchy bums tend to work best if you have a little bit of height as the longer length and the extra volume tends to shorten your frame. But petite girls, if you want to try the Bermuda trend, do not fret. You might want to try wearing fitted berms which we're about to cover next. So this pair is fitted through the leg. It's like your favourite skinny jeans, just half the length. So like your jeans, there are tons of possibilities with this one. And for a casual look, I took inspiration from the golf course. I styled it with this polo tee. If you want to go more geek chic with it, add a pair of glasses and button your collar up all the way. So to take this pair up a notch, I've chosen to throw on this slightly college-style blazer in a very varsity shade of navy. Cuff sleeves uh, balance out the look and the whole look is streamlined and adds polish. I would recommend wearing this with a pair of skinny oxfords because they are preppy, chic and very comfortable choice. So remember that a well-fitting pair of berms that flatters your figure and your frame is an essential base on which to build this look. So my tip is to play around with different berm lengths. You'll find that an inch or two sometimes you know, whether you wear it just above the knee, at the knee, or just below the nobliest part of your knee, sometimes makes all the difference. Remember to subscribe to my channel. If you want me to cover specific things, let me know in the comment box below. You can also catch up with me on Twitter, on Instagram, and on Facebook. See you till next time.